What is up YouTube Pinoy RC Freak over here once again Well, today's a special day, it's nice outside, not so sunny, not so gloomy Came from work and I've been dying to uh, test my Arma Vendettas for a long time This is a big sale on uh, Great Hobbies, my local hobby shop here in Edmonton, Alberta, Canada And then it's a kind of good deal So I got two of them, why not, right? We got like almost half price on each and then these are very brand new vehicles and then I've been dying to trying it out ever since last winter and then right now I'm gonna try it again As any of body of you know that um, I have a vehicle like a uh, Arma Felony and Arma Orange Felony and Arma Felony uh, Silver, Arma Felony Black They're 8 scales, I mean the others are 7 scales, these are, they are 6S, these are like 3S vehicles But they're very fast too they can uh, compete with those vehicles but I don't compete on like you know speed demons or speed runs or anything like that because the case yesterday and how fast it is and change the gearing, the gearing, high gearing, all stuff because here's the bash like you know I got a good deal of these vehicles that's why I got it and I haven't tried these vehicles yet for a long long time because I've been trying to uh, use it I also got an XL1 blue and I also an XL1 silver uh, that's made by Traxxas and yeah i'm gonna show it to you guys i just wanna you know share it to you guys like you know enjoy the hobby and all the stuff and then this is the this is the arma vendetta 6s version there's a eight scale vehicle they got a spectrum uh, electronics in there like spectrum uh, radio and all the stuff all the good stuff about the you know those connected i'm oh, sorry the arma connected to the spectrum brand they're pretty really good well enough talk i'm just gonna have fun guys so this is my vehicle right now hopefully you like it then you know this is my challenger to try to look like it but you know what it's awesome i know enjoy life man you only live once right so this is my vehicle here see arma vendetta just some minor decals in it try to make it look like what i want like a racer kind of thing yeah but this is my real car over here and also i've got a mitsubishi clips it's a jdm and you're gonna have a Japanese car if you're gonna have a muscle car but I tell you the truth muscle cars are so strong this is a 5.7 liter V8 right but the child the Eclipse is a better sports car that's a sports a real sport car Eclipse because it can handle like pretty good cool curves but this guy is just like a rocket it's just like this is like made for drag nothing special at all well I'm here right now in a flat space over here I'm gonna try the Arma Vendetta and also I'm planning to get the infraction too I don't have an infraction on the, the 6S version I'm gonna try to get an infraction 6S and also an infraction uh, on this version 3S alright guys hopefully you like this video and then um, I'll show you more running videos on this video alright Pinoy RC out <laughs> sorry Pinoy RC pick up bye what is up YouTube Pinoy RC Freak over here once again Well these are my two Vendettas right now made by Arma Today's special day, it's a nice day outside so I decided to run these vehicles I've been itching to run these vehicles for a long long time now It's my first time running these guys I had these guys for like almost a year but I never run it because I got it in the beginning of the, of the winter and I got in a big sale, that's why I got two of them. They're so awesome, I love them. On road cars, but I'm not really an on road car guy. I'm more than like a basher, some, something like that. But a little bit of everything is cool, right? But this is uh, my Vendetta right now. This is like a 3S power, and it's got a special electronics on it. It's factory, nothing done. I've been running with it lately, I mean uh, a couple of minutes ago then pretty cool, it's so smooth. I adjusted the shocks to be tighten it because if I didn't tighten it, it will just scrape the floor or I mean, scrape the ground and then scrape the bumper on it. Like but I know it's pretty thick so it's not running into, even though it runs through little rocks, it's not gonna like, you know, skid marks on it on the, on the bottom. So pretty good vehicle, it's pretty light. I'm running this parking lot right now, church parking lot, it's not that huge parking lot, it's kind of tight, but 
just nice run around circle.